Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 as England. Let us continue what we last left off. So, uh, I just noticed in the little speech bubble up here, uh, that apparently her father-in-law was just murdered in combat by some random mayor. So, that's why our alliance broke. Sucks, but what can you do about it? But like, what is the relationship between my wife and, uh, not, not the realm, my wife and the current emperor? Is there any relationship? I don't actually know. Family tree. No, you have no parents. So I have no idea who the hell you are. But apparently that's just, uh... You, still, you know what? We'll fight him for dinner. We'll lose 75 prestige, but that's okay. I have like 2,000. It's not a, it's not a big deal. Okay, he does not like me because apparently he doesn't like eating food. Very, uh, not really what I was expecting there. Let's sabotage some provinces. You, you know what? That might not be a bad, let's sabotage Sussex. And we're, like, this is the person who hates us. If we just, like, burn down their house, maybe things will work out. But you, you, my wife, my wife really likes me now, so that's good. We could gain kind. Don't give me any, she's keeping giving me excuses. I can imprison her, that seems like a little bit much. Do we gain kind? We have 30% chance of becoming kind. We didn't get it, we are apparently uncouth, which is this, it's symbolized by this nice little frog there. After being treated by the court physician, it's feeling much better. You know what, 2.8 gold, oh he's getting a raise now. Apparently I have a Wikipedia link as well. I mean, fr you are still doing pretty well. Like, how is your war against York going? 92% in favor of, du uh, of the Duke. Which is good. But it's going to give us actually a little bit of territory. It's going to make our Duke a little bit stronger as well. But it is going to make the realm as a whole better. Sure, you can, you can be married too. I think she's a bastard, so you can just have her. It's fine. I'm not too worried about it. There we go, we're getting some sabotage done. We do have a weak claim. Who are you? I could claim the entire Byzantine Empire for my wife. They have 16,000 troops and I do not. So that doesn't seem like a great idea. Who's leading the revolt right now? It's a claimant war, okay. Again, I, I don't think with 16,000 men and the, these guys being all the way in the Mediterranean, it's necessarily going to be easy. Okay, we'll send you in hiding because I'm pretty sure... Is somebody trying to kill my, my daughter? My sister's trying to kill my daughter. The one who's married to the guy in Navarra. Why do you not like me? Why are you trying to kill my daughter? You do not like me. And you won't. You're also in hiding, so I don't think we can really talk to you at all. A blessed ha has passed. Is there a new pope? Edgar of Wessex lived the pious life. Truly following the example of God. He passed on the 1st of November, 10, uh, 1078. He long wondered if he'd be considered a true Christian or not. Long ceremony was held in Edgar's home honor by the Pope to celebrate the life that he has lived. Is that good? Like, you're you're dead. Eh, bless be his name. So, there is currently a claimant war. I guess we did know was, uh, we knew what was coming. I can't raise troops here, unfortunately. We need to raise troops across the country. You come here. You guys make your way here. You break to that province. All of you guys are going to link up into London. They also claim... Seems like it's actually claiming the same amount of territory, so I'm not too sure what's happening there. Yeah, but you guys need to fall back. They are splitting up, which is kind of like a dumb thing for them to do, but... Can you land in Wessex? You can. 
Do we have enough ships to carry everybody? I think we do. Like, we should. Do you even like military stuff? You're an intrigue person, but you have, you have decent martial. Let's let's talk strategy. You do not. Why do you not like me? Female heir, disgusted foreigner. He's ambitious. We can antagonize him. We can threaten him. I mean, we'll, we'll, keep, we'll keep trying to sway you for right now, even though I think we do want to, in the end, just murder you. Uh, put you into the ships, get you over to here. But with 11,000 men, we should be able to win the war. Yeah, because they're all going to link up. That's not a huge surprise. We're still establishing Soulfolk, which is good. Trying to see my title. What are you talking about? Make him disappear. 750 gold. The 50 50 to keep. Like, what title are you trying to usurp? Where, where, like, you live in France. Who is this guy? Um, you live here? You know, I, I don't care about him. I'm, I'm sure it's actually just fine. But let's go up here. Like, again, I don't know who this guy really is. Or who he thinks he is. Okay, we'll take you out of hiding because apparently we don't need to be in hiding anymore. So, 12, 13, 12. Not put you in charge here. Put you in charge there. That seems okay. Uh, I know we are leading uh, the battle, which could theoretically get us killed. The group of smugglers in the city of Maine. A little bit sad, but that's okay. We have not captured you. We can stand down these boats. I don't even know where he went. He's just in France now. I mean, I guess I could just chase him. Because you don't really got to respect borders in uh, the medieval era. Vassal inheritance warning. Yeah, I mean, he's got a positive opinion of me. It's not zero. But I consider that to be a success. We have now arrested you. So, like, are you anybody? Like, if I was even to, um, to ransom you. You might not just not be worth anything. You were 10 gold. I'd rather just, like, cut your head off, to be honest. How's it tyrannical? He tried to replace... How? Tries to overtake my throne, and that's considered too much? I mean, we'll, we'll make him, uh... We'll embarrass him a little bit. That much, at least. I'm going to keep you guys in uh, France, just in case the French decide to attack us. They are by far probably the biggest threat to us. Is my is my sister still trying to kill her? She's got, like, no strength for her, but she's, she's trying. She's trying to fabricate a claim on the Duchy of York? Ever came claim on Duchy of this guy. I mean, he's like one of the least powerful dukes around, to be honest. We need to be like trying to break up. Like, how much territory does this guy have right now? He's got like all of this. I mean, he likes us a lot, which is nice, and he doesn't have any male heirs. But I, I think he's he can still definitely be a problem. I just don't think this dude likes us. I, I don't think... Who are you? My coordinator? He's, he's misguided? That's fine. 
I think these days really help me uh, getting to know and appreciate me better. What should I do? Because you have envious, brave. Yeah, no, we're, we're both brave. We're both brave people. You should at least, you know, plus 35 opinion. I'll take it for now. There's another adventurer from Norway. Or from Denmark, I should say. He would not accept. He's running an adventure against me, so he's a little bit upset. He's not just going to come to court, unfortunately. Okay, yeah, but the Pope does like us. And I'm not even sure, like, what do you do about all these adventures? Like, I don't even know what I did to... To deserve it. At least, like, the King of Norway, I can understand. Because he, he used to have a claim up here, but now he's got nothing. So I'm not too sure what their, uh... Intentions are. Okay, our sister did have a kid. Are you the one trying to... No, you're unmarried. You're not the one trying to kill my daughter. You did have a bastard. Do we, do we know who your father is? No, we do not. I do need you to marry somebody, though. We can marry into, into Hungary. You're seven? How old are you? You're 17? You're ambitious. Definitely don't want anybody ambitious. We want somebody who's, like, content. Patient, diligent. You're a hunchback. Who even are you? You're just some random person living in Italy. You're three years old. You're basically nobody good. What about Castile? Do you have anybody? You have a daughter? I'm trying to marry my daughter off, so that's not going to help me. Galicia? You also only have daughters. You have a 13-year-old son. You know what? Patrol between you and my daughter. There you go. In, uh, I think three years, you're going to have yourself a wife. And also an alliance with Leon, which I think does will help us out. My vassal, who are you? You're the I gave you territory and this is how you repay me? Been slandering me. In charge with slander. He'll either stay out of factions or be exposed. Is he in a faction? There's really no factions going on right now, to be honest. Uh, I'm gonna, th I'm, I'll threaten him and, uh, yeah, stay out of all factions. Cause I, I know you've been doing it. I know you've been up to stuff. Absolutely will not allow this in my court. Absolutely not. I'm kind of useless in all my stats. Can I take her to hiding? Find guardianship. I, I like, we want to teach you at some point. I mean, if, um, if my sister has it's like no plot power to even kill my daughter, then it might not even be worth, um, keeping her in hiding. So what do you do? The opinion goes up. Scandalous counselor. Most impressive woman has recently arrived at my court. Apparently the reason she, for her visit is to raise a trade agreement with local merchants. Well, people did not think much of her at first. Now that you've heard many courtiers praising her savvy business sense. You know what? Well, you can work for me. Idle council members. Oversee construction the capital. And let's just build some more stuff here. Castle Town. We don't have the technology to get that done right now. We don't want galleys. 50 light infantry, 50 archers. We'll get that done in less than a year uh, to build as well. It's not bad. It's only a 20. I have decent... No, that's him. My military exploits are sure to impress him. Or he's going to feel like I'm an idiot. 
I mean, we'll keep we'll keep a twenty opinion. A twenty opinion is fine. In fact, um, we're still trying to fabricate. Let's reprove religious relations with the Duke of York. May and maybe he will be like, "You are so cool. You got crowned by the Pope." I feel like that's a pretty big accomplishment. At least not too impressed by that. Okay, so let me just go back to plot. She has 15% strength. She has no backers. I, I don't think she needs to be in hiding, to be honest. She's probably fine. We do need a commander, though. First person we have is really 12. Okay, well, we'll put him in charge for now. Who are you? You're my sister? You're the one who is married. You're the one trying to kill my... Right? Constance? Not even, what do you mean? You're you're trying to kill my daughter. Shut up. It's not it's not your business. Who do you think you are? Actively trying to Actively trying to kill my daughter. And you think I'm just gonna listen to your advice about what I should be eating? Okay, so now there is a host war. Again, how many men do you have? 6,000. Well, we are going to raise these troops up. We'll have you guys just sit down here. To my liege, my great king Robert is not escaped me. The several of your commanders are lacking formal training and military tactics. Yeah, you know what? You can do it. I think that is fine. I think we're going to ignore you for now. I think... Are you recently conquered territory? You are. You keep taking over land. You literally own half the country right now. You have eight vassals yourself. How much money do you make? You make six... I mean, we do make more money than you. You're actually getting more prestige than I am. And I think you're probably also gaining more piety, yeah. You've also killed four people? How many people have I killed? I've also killed four people. You know what? Okay, that's fine. Fair enough. Okay, so you landed just straight into the capital. And you're, like, you're just led by one duke, right? Yeah, you're basically the Duke of Normandy. Okay, let's get these ships down to here. Uh, combine. Nope. Combine. You get onto the ships. Thank you very much. And let's go to Kent. Okay, we're playing some uh, games. Hopefully, again, hopefully he just ends up liking me a little bit more. 19. His opinion of me is actually decreasing right now. We can gain 20 prestige. Dedicated Carouser. Which is diplomacy plus two. Can I change this yet? I can. Let's, we'll go to you. And become a hedonist. Which is intrigue, diplomacy plus two. I mean, so that's actually just an upgrade. Fertility goes up. The Christian church doesn't like me very much. Or we get diplomacy plus three and then just a bunch of... Traction bonuses. I mean, entry going up by... I mean, it's already... It's at three. Let's become like a socializer. Yeah, apparently we're sick. What do we have? We just kind of feel sick. Okay, well that's disappointing. Can I actually get a better court physician? The answer apparently is no. And I'm not going to trust some random duke to... Uh, Make me feel better, to be honest, because I don't know if I really trust them too much. Is this your entire army? It says you have 5,000 men. Okay, no, they, they are now gone back down to... Uh, into Normandy. Well, that's okay. Our wife is pregnant. I mean, that seems pretty good. We kill you one more time. We're at 61%. Let's 
train up a handful more troops. Because we should already have enough men to basically fight you off. We're no longer sick, which is nice. And yeah, we don't want to cross a major river. Do I have commanders on every front? Okay, I do. And we... Oh, this front right here. Looks like it should collapse pretty easily, which is going to allow us, yeah, basically to completely route them out. Which I feel like that's pretty good. Sussex is independent. Why are you independent? Wait. What? I don't know why you're independent. We have another daughter. We'll name it after their mom, Anna. Nightmare's not over yet for your wife. Her recovery is only passing. Her conditions quickly worsen after giving birth. Well, I don't know if I can do anything about that, so I'm sorry. So the host is coming back. But my wife is feeling better. Hell yeah. Okay, so we've won the war here. The petty noble from Lyon has spent a week visiting Middlesex, constantly bragging about his wealth and estates back home. Insinuating his local peers uh, are behaving like royalty. We can write a complaint to you. So we'll ignore you for now. Yeah, I don't need a non-aggression pack with, uh, with Normandy. By the way, Sussex, can you explain to me why you are independent? We cannot declare war because we have our levies raised, so we need to decrease the levies. And you have 400 men. We're going to de jure claim this, obviously, for the Duke. You're, are you Duke of anything, or are you just Duke of one province? Just the Duke of Kent. The council's discontent. They didn't... I, why? It's... You love he's been raised for too long? It's fine. Like, are you guys mad at me? Female heir, foreign conqueror. You think I'm a tyrant? I don't even know what I did was tyrannical. I guess taking over Sussex, they don't like that too much. But, like, it did break away from me. So, I feel like I have a, a rightful claim to this land. I'm a tyrant until 1114. It's like 30 years. You also don't like me. I'm trying to give you land. What's wrong with you? And you will not end your plot. What is your plot? You're trying to become king of England? Absolutely not. Uh, so we are going to do... Council positions. You got to... The press revolt in Kent. And we're just going to try to arrest this man. There we go. He's locked away. So I guess I'll just become the Duke of Kent. So, uh, can I revoke your title? Does it lower his opinion? No, okay, so this does cost... A little bit of infamy. Not a little bit of infamy, a little bit of uh, opinion. And like, I just gave this guy land. Like, I can ransom for 145 bucks. I could humiliate him. I can throw him a new blet. Who's your heir? Does someone like random daughter? Put in house arrest. I don't know, like, what do I do with you? But the, 
Humiliating them does release them from prison. So, for right now, I'm going to throw you an oublet. Maybe you should have tried to fabricate a claim against me. That's all I'm going to say. But I think it's going to be a good time for us to end this episode. So, thanks everybody for watching my Anthem. If you enjoyed, my thumbs up. And now, Joey, can always come down. If you want to see more, subscribe. And goodbye.